Hello and welcome back to another vlog. If you're new here, my name is JP. I'm your new homegirl. I'm on my way to the gym to get my body like Beyonce, but hey. <laughs> and if you're returning, welcome back. Today is Friday, October the 20th. Happy Friday. Mm -mm 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 -mm. It is 9.24. Your girl is up early trying to get this workout in chill and i also stopped at the store and got a prime this is the tropical punch flavor i've already opened it because your girl needed a pick me up before she picked y'all up but cheers i hope you guys are having a fantastic start to your friday um i decided to come out early and get my workout in because we having more computer issues. I mean, not really computer issues. I don't wanna reach. It's not a computer issue this time. Uh, the software that I use to import my invoices in the system um, isn't working. In my job's defense, we did get a new software. Uh, we're running parallel with the new software. My team is the, I, I believe, the last team on the like accounting side of things that has not started using the new software. If that's what you call a child, I mean, I would assume it's called software. But anyway, so um, we have, as of recently, been having a lot of connection issues. Um, it kicks us out while we're still working in it. Or like in today's case, when I went to log in, basically it gives me an error message and doesn't allow me to log in. Um, and then I have to reach out to IT. IT does something on their side. And then once they tell me I'm good to log in, that's when I get back in the system and begin to work i know it is a hassle um it's kind of ghetto but it's my life it is what it is at the current moment but i use this opportunity to go ahead and just get my workout in early because why not i've already done payroll you guys know that um so i mean at this point all i gotta do is just get those last few invoices in and then i'm i should it should be quiet for the rest of the day. The crowd meter at um, Planet Fitness said that it's a one, but this look like a two. Uh -uh. My arms are still sore in the event you're wondering from the workout that me and Zay did. Baby, I have got to tap into that arm machine. One more again. Hold on, y'all. Okay. I've got to tap into that arm machine one more again, y'all, because all of this hurts like all of this hurts and all of this hurts and that's exactly what i need so shout out to zay for putting me onto that machine because i don't use the one that uh we were on and i don't even think that um i don't even think that i showed you guys the machine basically you put your elbows down and you hold like these little you know i don't i was about to call it stick things child that was such a girl moment you hold like these little handles and then you push down and you push it and it works all right here this muscle here and then it works the back what, what's that called <laughs> i don't know okay i just know that it's sore and i know that it worked so we're gonna run that back again do the stairs and then hopefully oh let me get my air pods out hopefully i can get on the other machines that i typically get on when i'm in here but we'll see because like i said i mean hell it's people walking up right now I thought it was going to be a one. I thought I was doing some child, but apparently I'm not the only person that thought coming to get a workout early this Friday morning was a good idea. So I'm going to stop chit-chatting with y'all. I hope you have a fantastic start to your Friday. I'll see you guys in the gym. hello Woo. yes praise god for that workout much much needed y'all i wish i had somebody to record me well, number one let me start out by saying this workout was really good i spent 70 well an hour and 18 minutes 
is what I spent in the gym. Really good, didn't feel rushed. Um, I did the machines that I wanted to do. Um, so I feel really good, praise God for that. So look y'all, <laughs> that machine that I was telling y'all about where you put your elbows up like this and then you kind of do this motion and it's weighted, right? So today I get on the machine, I'm by myself of course, so you know, I don't know how to work everything, adjust everything, you know, customize it to <laughs> my size. And the machine that, you know, telling y'all this right here, it, it was higher than it was before. So I'm looking, right? Because I'm like, nah, this, this is not right. I don't remember it being so high up. So I'm looking, 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 y'all. Don't see where I can make the adjustment. So I was like, you know what? Just screw it. I'm going to go ahead and do a couple sets. Gone on about my day. So I'm up here, right? Hold on, because my shirt large. Let me. So the thing is like up here, right? I'm going, I'm extending like this when it should be like this. But I'm up here with it. Child, I know for a fact I look hooked on phonics. I I know I look stupid. I only did like four reps and I hurry up and got off the machine because I was like them them Planet Fitness people that y'all be seeing on TikTok that be looking crazy as hell. They really exist. If I was one of those type of vloggers, I would go straight in and record the foolishness that I see those people freaking exist like i'm talking about from the people that just be running all crazy on the treadmill to the folks that be doing real fast reps to the folks that don't even use the machine correctly child but they just really confident and going for what they know and feel like they doing it right and they probably you know what i mean I, mm, child i don't know what people's life story is but what i do know is that those type of people that you see on the Planet Fitness memes that deter a lot of people from joining Planet Fitness because it appears that everybody that is a member of Planet Fitness got mental issues. <laughs> they exist, they really do exist. I'm here to tell you, I've seen it with my own eyes. And I felt like today I, I was a candidate for one of them people. Like, I was like, Lord, let me go ahead and get off this machine. I don't want nobody record me looking totally crazy on this machine because elbows way up here trying to extend child i'm shaking all over the place i'm talking about like a leaf on a tree child it was just a whole mess so that's why i was laughing at myself because i really gave it all that i had but i knew i wasn't i wasn't using the machine like I could have been because it just wasn't adjusted to my size. But aside from that little minor mishap or whatever, I had a really good workout. Um, I did get a message from IT saying that the systems should be up and going. It's currently 1051. So I'm gonna head back to the crib. I'm gonna probably stop at the car wash. Um, it's still early in the morning. So I feel like if I go now, I'll beat the crowd and the rush of people that's trying to get their car clean for the weekend because it's supposed to be beautiful this weekend. And then I'm debating whether or not I wanna go to Sam's Club because I am just about out of, uh, what I need a child? trash bags i was about to say tissue paper but i got tissue paper i'm just about out of trash bags i think i have one left in the box and i prefer to get my trash bags from sam's because they last us a couple months versus going you know getting a smaller bag or whatever a smaller box that is of trash bags so since i'm passing this this way i might as well go ahead and do that and Child, now these people up in here talking about something. We got the flu shot if you need to leave me alone. Sam. Oh, y'all, look at these bath mats for $11.98. I really, really want to get some, but I'm looking for a black and they don't have any. But that's a really good price, though, for them bath mats. I'm getting dry for your baby girl. Smoking near the top for your baby girl. Burn somebody block for your doorway. You made me feel these days. Oh, my baby, she my shorty. We rockin'. We got our shoes all up in the press. My baby, we rockin'. You lose right there every time you cry. Go to sleep and wake up on your side. Endless love I always provide. They hating on us, and you should know why. But who's been loving you lately? Who's willing to go half on the baby? Our Sam's run is done, y'all. 
I was just watching my good, well, not just watching my good sis, Carolina Key, but I was watching her while I was working out. And first of all, sis, during there, almost had me fall off the doggone machine because she's so freaking hilarious. But in today's vlog, I think she uploaded it yesterday, but that's besides the point. In today's vlog, she was like, you know, um, I have a real toxic relationship with food. Like, me and food go together real bad. And I was like, ooh, girl, baby, say it. Please say it, because that's really me. I have a real toxic relationship with food and grocery shopping. Like, I know y'all heard me say I was going up in there for trash bags only. For trash bags only. Like, <laughs> girl, what is wrong with you? What's wrong with you? Then I make the mistake every time. Make the mistake every time. A couple mistakes. First mistake is I don't beeline straight to where I need to go. I walk around a little bit. Why I do that? That's ignorant. That's ghetto and that's trifling. I should just go to where I need to go. That's problem number one. Problem number two is I keep on being courteous and calling my family to see if they need something from the grocery store. That's really where I be going wrong at. I mean, once, you know, obviously me, me rolling around all the sections of the store knowing good and well i said i was coming in there for only one item so on top of that saying you only want to go in there for one item and then you call people that always seemingly need something then that caused me to walk around even more see see most stuff child i walked about it up with a whole six piece sheet set yes i'm i was still sleeping with the comforter and the flat sheet all this time several blocks ago i told y'all that I had to throw away my fitted sheet because for whatever reason, child, it lost the elastic. I'm talking about elastic came totally undone and it was basically like I had two flat sheets all this time. It has, it has to have been at least two months since I threw away my flat sheet. I mean, my fitted sheet. Baby, we just been thugging and loving it. And, to, and honestly, to me, it hasn't felt like any different, but the price on that six piece uh, sheet set at Sam's Club. I just couldn't pass it up. I low-key wanted that Christian Sarantino bed uh, sheet set, that six-piece sheet set, because that one was like even cheaper than the one I picked up. The one I picked up was $24. Still good in comparison to what I've seen at other stores, which is why I hadn't picked up a sheet set, because baby, the, the prices, god dang, it's like, baby, is this a comforter set? Is this a bed in a bag? Or is this basic sheets? I just need to know because the price ain't pricey. Like, it just doesn't make sense to me why it's so high just for some sheets. I'm talking about no pillowcases, no none of that. Just a flat sheet, fitted sheet. I think it did come with pillowcases. But it was still high nonetheless, which is why I hadn't purchased any. I checked a couple places like Macy's, Target. Uh, but Sam's was the cheapest I saw, so I just went ahead and grabbed it. So that's why how I ended up with that. But child, that other stuff, that other stuff really is my family. That's we just gonna blame it on the people that I live with, child. They do it every single time they do it to me. Every single time they do it to me. And this is really ghetto. Anywho, I'm on my way now to the car wash to go ahead and tackle that. And then I'm headed to the house. I'll see you guys when I make it to the car wash. Here are my pickups from Sam's Club. I picked up some of this sandwich bread from Mrs. Baird's. Hopefully I'm saying that brand right. I also got some Sara Lee sesame seed hamburger buns, gourmet style, y'all see it. I also picked up some more mustard cause we were totally out. A three pack of Heinz ketchup. I think I was down to one bottle. Some of Isaiah's favorite chips, the Flamin' Hot Cool Ranch Doritos. This is a first time pickup. 
y'all know Isaiah uh, really likes the pre-made burgers from HEB. When I did my last HEB curbside order, I put some in my cart, well actually purchased some and um, they didn't have any in stock so they refunded the money. So I decided to try these flame grilled Angus beef patties. We're actually gonna have them tonight for dinner with some fries. So I'll keep you guys posted on how I like these. Husband's request is this uh, Celsius variety pack. I told y'all in the car we were down um, to one bag, trash bag that is. So I picked up this hefty 90 bag trash bag box. I really, really like this box and it lasts us a long time. We are not out of cold drinks, but, but I decided to pick this up since it was on sale. Normally this 35 pack is about $20, like 18, 19 bucks, but they had it on sale today for $15, excuse me, y'all. And there were only two pallets left, this one and another one. So I just decided to pick it up. And lastly, here is the soft wash sheet set that I got from Sam's Club. This is the Members Mark brand, and it is a six piece set. And these are the items that I got from the grocery store. Well, sorry, that I got from Sam's. Good afternoon. It is 4.10. It has been a couple hours since I picked you guys up. I have obviously gotten myself fresh and clean and got myself together. Um, work has kind of kind of picked up it's kind of been busy definitely not the slow day that i anticipated that i would have considering that i stayed about 30 minutes late yesterday doing payroll but it is what it is um it should be tapering off and should get quiet until five o'clock um in between work i also filmed two collaborative videos i'm starving y'all but at this point because it's close to my dinner time, I'm just gonna wait and then make the burgers and fries and that'll be my one meal for the day. Not that I was intentionally trying to eat one meal, that's just how it worked out today. Sis is only going to eat one meal and I might snack a little bit after um, I eat my burgers and fries, just depending on burger and fries. And I want y'all to think I'm gonna have a whole plate of burgers, shell. My burger and fries depending on how hungry i am after the fact but i just wanted to check in with you guys if you hear noise child that's my washroom definitely washing and drying clothes um i typically don't on a friday but i for whatever reason had a pretty hefty load that needed to be washed and so instead of waiting until sunday i decided to go ahead and knock it out today we were also supposed to go to King's Flea Market or King's Best Mall um, to pick up Zay and Bay's necklace. If you guys can remember a couple vlogs back, we took both of their necklaces to the jeweler to have it repaired. Child, it's been, it's been ready for several days now. I had all the intentions in the world to go by there and pick it up today, but because of the time, I'm not going to worry about it. We'll just go Sunday. They are open on Sunday. I just can't picture myself rushing to head out of here, even though they don't close until like 7, to head out of here at 412 to go sit in traffic, to get there, pick up the jewelry and sit in Motrack. Like, it's not that serious. They have other pieces of jewelry they can wear, other necklaces that they can wear. So I'll be sure to pick it up on Sunday. So if y'all could just remind your girl, cause I was supposed to go get it last Sunday and totally forgot. So please tap me on my shoulder if I seem like I have forgotten on Sunday, but hopefully I won't Lord willing. So because I plan on staying here at the house, the only uh, thing that I have on my agenda for this evening is to take it easy. I wanna chill. I'm going to go sit out in my garage. It's a beautiful day. It's sunny. The, um, the weather was pleasant when I was out there earlier, meaning that it wasn't too hot uh, nor too windy. So I want to be able to, you know, tap into that a little bit and just relax. I feel like I've been moving around and up on my feet since I pretty much have been home. And I just want to take, you know, 30 minutes to an hour before I come in for uh, dinner, to make dinner that is, to just kind of decompress and take some time to myself. <laughs> What is up fam? It is much later and I am whispering because my bedroom door is open and husband is asleep. Y'all, that whole meal today slammed. That burger and fries was bomb and I'll definitely be buying those uh, pre-cooked 
patties from Sam's Club again because they were a hit across the board. Bay and Zay also ate and they enjoyed it as well. And speaking of enjoy, I hope that you all enjoyed hanging out with me in this vlog. If you did, please be sure to give it a huge thumbs up. If this is your first time seeing my face, don't leave a stranger. Hit that subscribe button to join the fam and hit that post notification bell so that you never miss another one of my uploads. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. I should make